In Vietnamese culture, we don't say I love you, we say did you eat yet, and there is a profound cultural reason why it's so important for our parents to confirm if we've eaten yet as the utmost gesture of affection. As one of our noble proverbs teaches, Có thực mới vực được đạo. By loose translation, it means you must eat in order to conquer your study. Study here could be taken in its literal meaning, the academic education that we must conquer in order to achieve in life, but study can also mean any and all challenges, grief, obstacles, stress that life throws at us, something we all know too well after centuries of constantly being exposed to the stressors of war, famine, and oppression. So whether we're just studying for a college entrance exam, or running from bombs, or watching French colonizers pill and seize our homes after killing our loved ones, our ancestors knew that in order for our bodies to have the strength to deal with these stressors that have seeped deeply into our genetics memories, we must first be nourished in any way we can, even if it's just two small bowls of porridge to split among four people. So when I come home to visit and my mom greets me with, did you eat yet, while pointing at my favorite tomato tofu dish she had waiting for me, I simply nod and say, no man, I haven't, did you eat yet?